Alright. Back, back, back. Let's see where I'm at. Okay. Let's resume. Hmm. Hmm. So I was just told that Saren was a good guy and uh, blah blah blah. I need to find uh, that one dude. Where am I going? That way, I guess. This way. This storm actually make me move faster at all? I don't know. It doesn't look like it. Looks like I'm going the same speed. Oh, where do I want to go? I think that's where I'm supposed to go. Either for one quest or another. Gentleman's Club. Okay. That's him. Oh, damn. Assassins. Those were Saren's men. That's it. Bag him and tag him. Bag him and tag him. Something. Sif Ford. <laughs> the hell is that? <laughs> there we go. Commander. What do you want? I'm here on Shaira's behalf. Your lies are hurting her. Good! Her lies have been killing me for days. I've seen a lot of horrible things in my days, and there's only one woman in this damn galaxy that helps me forget it. So if you feel that way, then why spread lies about her? Because she rejected me! Me! Septimus Oraka, General of the Turian Fleet! Is she really worth it? There must be other women. It's not just any woman I want. It's her, and her alone. Look, kid, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but don't waste your time. You need to start acting like a general if you want to beat this. I spent all my life acting like a general, and what did it get me? Huh? No, those days are over. I'll just be what I am, a tired, lonely, worn-out soldier. You're a damn general. Quit your You're whining. A damn general. Ha! You got balls, kid. There are only five people in this damn galaxy who talk to me like that. So you think it's that easy? Just straighten up and act like a general? I don't think it could hurt. Huh. Maybe you're right, Commander. Shaira's worth the effort. Even if she won't have me back. Now get up and get moving, General. All right. I'll go to her. After I've had a cold shower. Cold shower? <laughs> two. Say, you're a bright kid. Would you be interested in earning a few extra credits? What do you want me to do? There's an Elcor diplomat out there who believes...
believe Shaira gave up his secrets. Why does he think that? Because I told him. Look, <laughs> I just need you to convince him of the truth. What makes you think you'll believe me? You'll bring him proof. Take this data pad. It shows where I got my info. It will exonerate Shaira and convince the Elcor. Who am I taking it to, and where is he? His name is Zaltan. He's an Elcor diplomat. He's over in the embassies complaining about Shaira. Oh, okay. Well, here's to soldiers acting like soldiers. Thanks, Commander. You know, you might make a good general yourself one day. Will I? Hard to imagine a general like that getting so upset about a woman. That's because... Back off, Rex. Fizz told us to take you down if you Rex, show up. Huh? What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. This is Fist's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. What was that all about? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. <laughs> Alliance military. I could have been a Marine, you know. Instead, I joined the goddamn Citadel Security. Biggest mistake of my life. Harkin, right? I was told you could help me find someone. A Turian CSEC officer named Garrus. Garrus? <laughs> you must be one of Captain Anderson's crew. Poor bastard still trying to bring Saren down, eh? I know where Garrus is. You gotta tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? Is there something I should know about the captain? The captain used to be a specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush-hush. The first human ever given that honor, and then he blew it. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians <laughs> set him up. You said they covered all this up. How'd you hear about it? I spent 20 years working cases here on the Citadel. People on this station love to talk. Secrets are like herpes. If you got them, you might as well spread them around. Sad. <laughs> uh... Pure pig. Just noticed that now, did you? Why'd they kick him out? Have to ask him. I never heard any of the details. Bet it's a good story, though. The heroes fall. Classic tragedy. <laughs> Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the wards. Last I heard, he was going back there. What's it like working for CSEC? You mean, what was it like? Executors suspended me without pay. Recurring violations. CSEC was keeping a file on me. Can you believe that? Every mistake yeah, I, I could, ever made I could believe that. books. Get a little rough with a suspect, note in the file. Have a couple of drinks on duty, note in the file. <laughs> Skim a couple of credits off a drug bus, note in the file. It's a goddamn witch hunt. Serves you right, bro. You off easy if you ask me. What the hell do you know? Working for c second like being a Marine. People get pissed off if we shoot somebody. Investigations, inquiries, rules, regulations. Every day I plow through enough red tape to choke a rhino. That's how you gotta be to do this job. So don't talk to me about right and wrong. You soldiers got it easy. Quit you blaming need to look others. Up Sober up and take some responsibility for yourself. Save your sermons. This ain't no church. I'm out of here. Yeah, good. Go. Let me drink in peace. The back rooms are private, reserved for Fist and his friends. Fist? Who's Fist? He owns this club, but the customers have to stay out front. What did that other Krogan want? Rex? Personal matter. Rex? Not real chatty, is he? Goodbye. Enjoy the club. Why do you 
Captain Anderson tell us he used to be a Spectre? Maybe it's not true. Harkin's an ass. I bet he's just messing with our heads. season talk to that one dude <laughs> uh, I want to go this way welcome to the presidium allow me to be your guide right Strained greeting, human. This is really not a good time. I know who revealed your secret. It was a Turian named Septimus. Unbelieving. I know this Septimus, and he could not learn my secrets. The only way he could learn them is from the Asari consort. Not true. Look at this. Confused. This is difficult to fathom. If the Turian could learn this on his own, dismayed, anyone can discover my secret. The Septimus is a powerful man, and it wasn't easy for him to find. Relieved. <clears throat> I suppose you are correct, human. <coughs> Thank you for this information. Startled realization. I must speak with the consort. She will be most displeased with my actions. Anxious oh, request. Please, human, if you will excuse me, I must go now. I'm sure she'll forgive you. It was an honest mistake. Doubtful. Perhaps you are right, human. I can only hope so. Thankful. That was a great thing you did, Commander. Approving. You see, then not all humans are as you say. I'm sure the Earth Clan stands to profit from this in some way. Apologetic. Surprised welcome. You have returned, human. Genuine inquiry. What may I do for you this day? Goodbye, Ambassador. Goodbye. Sincere farewell. Good day to you, human. Enjoy your time on the Citadel. Need to go to the medic. <sighs> Come on. Fin financial district. Upper wards. Okay, financial district and the. Uh, out over here. So go across the bridge and go to the right. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. This way, right? Yeah. over here.
Barla Vaughn. What's this? One of the Earth Clan. Ah, a very famous one, yes? You are the one called Shepard. It is a great honor to welcome the heroes of the Blitz. You've got me at a disadvantage here. Forgive me, Earth Clan. My name is Barla Vaughn. My job makes it necessary for me to keep informed. I am a financial advisor to many important clients here on the Citadel. When someone as important as yourself arrives on the station, I take notice. I've heard you work for the Shadow Broker. Do you have any information about Saren? You're very blunt, Shepard. But you're right. I am an agent for the Shadow Broker. And I do know something about Saren. I hear your information can be expensive. Normally, this information would cost a small fortune. But these are exceptional circumstances. <coughs> so I am going for to give free, it to huh? you for free. Why, thank you. What's the catch? There is no catch. The Shadow Broker is quite upset with Saren right now. They used to do a lot of business until Saren turned on him. Saren's turned on a lot of people. I don't know the details, but the Shadow Broker hired a freelancer to deal with it. A Krogan mercenary. I think I know him. His name's Rex. Yes, I believe he's the one. I heard he was paying a visit to Citadel Security. If you hurry, you might catch him before he leaves the CSEC Academy. Isn't it strange that a Krogan would want to speak with CSEC? Very. However, <coughs> I doubt the visit was entirely his choice. You'll need to speak with him if you want to know more. What's it like living here on the Citadel? The station is without a doubt the greatest wonder in the galaxy. It is a technological marvel, but its true splendor goes much deeper than the hull and engines. From the Presidium to the wards, the entire station is a testament to the success of the Council. All the species of Citadel spaced together in a single strong community. I should go. Goodbye. Goodbye, Commander. So I want to go to CSEC now? That's HQ. Citadel, go to Rex. Garrus. CSEC Academy. There's the HQ right there. Oh, do I need to speak with... Oh yeah, I should probably speak with her again. Commander, I recently <coughs> received a lovely note from Septimus. Thank you for speaking with him. Even the Alcor diplomat has withdrawn his campaign against me. It was my honor to aid you. You are too kind, Commander. But I would not expect you to help me out of the kindness of your heart. I also have one more thing to give you, if you are interested. What are you offering me? I offer a gift of words. An affirmation of who you are and who you will become. I see your skin, <clears throat> tough as the scales on any Turian, unyielding. A wall between you and everyone else, <coughs> but it protects you, makes you strong. It is that strength that people are drawn to. It is why you lead and others follow without question. You will need that leadership in the battles to come. 
This may be who you are, but it is not who you will become. It only forms the basis for your future greatness. Remember these words when doubt descends, Commander. You have quite a gift, Shaira. Thank you. Not everyone appreciates it as you do. Never underestimate the power of words. Here, Commander. In light of your efforts with the Elkor Ambassador, I would like you to have this small trinket. A trinket? What is it? A small mystery. I have never learned its use or purpose, but I sense it is time for me to pass it on. And now I must ask you to leave. I have done everything I can for you. Remember my words, Commander Shepard. They will give you strength. So that does more. Let's see. It does more, right? Yep. Getting that guy. First day deploys med kit med medi gel to all wounded members, restoring their health. Okay. Got three points. Radio, radio. You're with the Alliance? My brother's a private back on Earth. My brother's a private. Okay. Med clinic. Cool. I can just warp right there. Smart dog. Now, if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or we'll... Who are you? Let her go. Ah! This guy's a baller. Just 
kill them both. All targets down. Nice. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. That's a pretty baller shot, man. You took him down clean. Sometimes <coughs> you get lucky. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you. All of you. Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. They want <coughs> to shut me up. Keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. Does this have anything to do with the investigation into Saren? I think it might. Dr. Michelle, tell us what happened. A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Where is she now? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. She must have something that proves he's a traitor. Did the Quarian mention anything about Saren or the Geth? She did. The information she was going to trade. She said it had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. You're a Turian. Why do you want to bring him down? I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the Council and a disgrace to my people. Welcome aboard, Garrus. Welcome you know we aboard, are the Garrus. only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. <clears throat> What's he doing there? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. Fowler. Okay. God, all these emails, what do they want? Sure. Got a renegade. I never properly thanked you for saving me from Fist's thugs, Commander. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't been there. I'm just glad you weren't hurt. Me too. Now, was there anything you needed? Let me take a look at what you have for sale. Of course. I oh, she sell stuff? Okay. <laughs> oh, wow, that's a lot of money. I'm pretty broke. Armor upgrades. How do you... That's my current one. Oh. Okay. I see you add little things like that to it. Not bad.
There we go. Bigger than it looks, really? huh? Okay. I kind of get where I'm at. <clears throat> Journal, expose Saren. Take fist down, but first I should probably get Rex. Elevator. Really? In light of the recent attack on Eden Prime, many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. Does it really take this long to get in the elevator? Come on, man. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. Go on. Get out of here. Do I know you, human? My name's Shepard. I'm going after Fist. Thought you might want to come along. <sighs> Commander Shepard? Commander Shepard. I've heard a lot about you. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. <coughs> My people have a say. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. Glad to have you on the team, Rex. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. So he has no tech. He's a combat guy. This way. Got my new dudes. about it, Garrus? Is this better than c -Sec? Fighting a rogue specter with countless lives at stake and no regulations <coughs> to get in the way? I'd say that beats c -Sec. 
There may just be hope for you yet, Turian. Turian. Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? Damn I was right, in Minwar yeah. during the Blitz. Saw you on the vids when you got your medal. You saved the whole colony. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry, I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang. Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? Do you know a CSEC officer named Harkin? I shouldn't really say too much. He's been on the force a lot longer than me. But I've heard that drinking on the job, taking bribes, that kind of thing. Rumors mostly, <clears throat> but they suspended him, so some of it must be true. How do you like working here on the Citadel? This place is amazing. I've been here almost a year, and I still haven't seen a tenth of it. The Presidium's just so beautiful. Good place to go and relax. But I really like it here down in the wards. There's always something going on somewhere. Like that new club they just opened a few months ago, Flux. Wicked scene in there, Commander. You should check it out when you have some time. I have to go. Right. You're probably real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. Just examine it. I was hoping to hop on to that thing. Wong. I'm an investigative journalist working here on the Citadel. Could I have a moment of your time? What do you need? I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places I can't go. I was hoping you might share anything you find during your own investigation. I can make it worth your time. You've got to have access to better sources. Why contact me? I'm using every source I can find, but I think I've got a better shot with you. I've read your file. If anyone is going to uncover corruption here, it's the hero of the Skillian Blitz. No promises. But if I find anything relating to your case, I'll inform you. Thank you, Commander. You won't regret it. <clears throat> Go to the Hydra system. Yeah. you've just come back from the colonies. Will you be needing supplies? What colonies are you talking about? Oh, my mistake, Earth Clan. I assumed... It doesn't matter. Pharos? Novaria? <laughs> well, if you haven't heard of them yet, I'm sure you will soon. But it doesn't matter where you hail from. My goods are available to all. Show me what you've got. Show me what you're working with. Most excellent. I am sure you will find something pleasing. Oh, everything's too expensive. Commander Shepard, 
the hero of Eden Prime. I am so honored to meet you. Nice to meet you. And you are? My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. I spend most of the time trying to stay alive and help the colonists. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Sure, why not? Here you go. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. I'll let you get back no to work. Or oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. Thanks again. I need drink on Earth, huh? It's actual journal. Started up a quest line. Wait, am I going to the... Oh, it's all the way over there. 